Another Caribou Coffee location in Bemidji recently opened its doors, or rather its windows. While it's only a go to a to go service for its opening, this new location is looking to serve more than its customers. Reporter Mary Balstead has more. Whether it's a cup of joe in the morning or a little late night pick me up, coffee is part of almost everyone's day. And now Bemidji has another option for those on the go in the form of a caribou drive through. We had our soft opening on Friday, but then today is our grand opening and it's like, yeah, it's just nice. Like we've actually had a bunch of traffic this morning. This team have worked really, really hard to get this going. This has been going on for months. So it was really important to me that the team felt supported, celebrated, and we all led into our core values every day. The new Caribou Coffee location is a to-go service only. The decision to operate as such was formed by increasing trends of on-the-go customers. Our guests want speed and they want to be able to move on with their day fast, so definitely a drive through location is the way to go. We have a lot of customers that were coming to our other location on the other side of town. So being on this side of town was more convenient for like college and for all the like nursing and all the different people that come through here in Bemidji. I uh, am very happy that uh, in the summertime, <laughs> within walking distance from the club, I'll be able to get a caramel high rise. Along with the drive through component, there is also a walk up window. And for every coffee that is purchased over this weekend, the Caribou Coffee will donate $1 to the Boys and Girls Club of the Bemidji area. Whenever Caribou opens a, a new store, we always partner with a local gift back and we pick the Boys and Girls Club because we like to support young people. It's going to be really exciting to see how much we can actually give back. Um, to the community and help these young kids. This helps us uh, to achieve our mission and to support kids in the Bemidji area to uh, learn skills about academic success, healthy lifestyles, and good character and citizenship. I'd rather have more traffic and smaller ticket for the Boys and Girls Club so that way they make more money versus the big ticket. <laughs> Reporting from Bemidji, Mary Balsted, Lakeland News. The fundraiser for the Boys and Girls Club of the Bemidji area will go through Sunday, February 5th. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.